a lot of people hear about uh, all the perks at the Google campus. Mm -hmm. um, can you give us a little bit of insight as to the culture at Google? And um, my kind of my main question here is, you know, is there a default to open mentality there? Well, you know, I, I would love to tell you that that's the truth, but I mean, most people, you know, uh, at a company like Google, uh, there's a default to coding. Okay. Right. And and some of those projects are open, some of those are closed. But then we also have people who are very passionate about open source. And what we try to do in their case is, is get to know them and say, okay, you're going to be patching. You know, which projects matter to you, and 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 just make sure they're they're putting, uh, you know, both our best face forward, but also uh, meeting the right people in okay. open source because. Um, it's very rare, but there are some projects that are very difficult to deal with uh, as, a, as a larger company and as an employee of a larger company. And so we make sure that they get the right, right kind of attention. Similarly, uh, you know, contributor license agreements mm -hmm. have become um, way more popular over the last couple of years. And some are completely signable uh, and, in fact, are often based on the Apache contributor license right. agreement, yeah. which is the same one we use at Google. Um, and so that's usually very easy, and so we make a, make a point of making those very efficient uh, when, when a Google goes to sign those. Other CLAs are not as easy to sign because they carry copyright assignment and often patent assignment clauses that are too, you know, uh, grabby. Sure. You know, <laughs> and so uh, in those cases, we usually end up pushing back on the project that wants that kind of thing, and they often change uh, because they still want our patches. Yeah. You know. Um, and, and then in some cases, we'll release patches wholly separate from our project, okay. uh, you know, and independent of their desire to have grabby clauses in their CLAs. So, so <laughs> you know, we exist in, in, in those conversations to basically protect Google and to protect Googlers and to protect open source people from yeah. Googlers who are not always so savvy, you know.